Kamada is the true definition of a big game player. Two goals against Arsenal to put Frankfurt through to the next round, and now a hat-trick against Salzburg. This card is well deserved, but the real question is, is it good enough and does it even make it into a Japanese team? Hi everyone, I'm Ghost Masala and welcome back to another episode of Road 3 Hokkaido, a series where I take a Japanese team and try and do some challenges and objectives. And well, the target at the moment is trying to get prime moment in the Carter, which is going to be trickier said than done, but I'll talk about that in later. First of all, let's take a look at Kamada. Now I'm going to play him at CF just because, you know, you can't drop Kubo, he's just undroppable. So I played Kamada as sort of a striker. I need a new striker anyway, so I thought it would be a good opportunity to use him there. I'm using a Hunter on him, of course, doesn't have the full effect because he's not on full chemistry. But he's got really, actually really surprisingly good stats. I didn't think he would be as good as this. Uh, pace is too slow for a wing as well, which does really help. Uh, that I'm playing as a striker, but you know, shooting wise, he's, he's got shoot, good shooting stats in the right areas, good finishing, good shot power um, for a 79 anyway. Passing is good enough, dribbling is really good as well, which is always crucial. He should be a good striker to be honest uh, for a Japanese team if you want to play Nakata further back. Of course, you might, of course, want to play Nakata further forward, but then of course, you can't manage who you want. I can, you got Minamino and Miyoshi, which is not the best option. So, th it's just a different option. I mean, it's really good and it's a really well deserved card as well. You know, cards like Nakajima and Shoji and Yamaguchi, you know, they're not deserved. This card is really well deserved from Kamada, he's played really well. So so it's just good to see that. Uh, I wish they did more upgrades rather than just random cards if that makes sense. Yeah, I'll talk about that. So basically, Shoji would have gone upgraded. He's gone back to Gamba Osaka to play in the J League um, along with Higashiguchi and um, a couple of other players. And he didn't get the upgrade, which is a bit disappointing. Uh, he needed the upgrade as well. He wasn't as good as Tomiyasu. Again, a bit disappointing, but there we go. And finally, let's talk about Nakata because he is very expensive and I'm still on the road to get him. Hopefully I'll get a loan one too, which would be good if I'm lucky. But yeah, Nakata's looking about 1 mil, and as you can see the top left hand corner, I'm quite far away from that. I haven't played FIFA for about a week, so, you know, still looking for it. You know, the moment they chose was a bit strange for Nakata. I thought he had a couple of better moments. He, they chose him getting three assists in the qualifying. I thought he, they could have chosen a couple of better moments than that. But you know, that card, and oh yeah, I guess I I guess I should should look at this card, but it looks amazing. And yeah, if you have this card, of course, use him at striker. But yeah, I'll get into a game, and yeah, let's see how the new Kamada does. Okay, the team is looking very good, to be honest. Payet, Osimen, Griezmann, uh, that guy, a few, lots of other players. It's not amazing, but it's good. But I've seen a lot better teams than that, so... But yeah, the attack looks pretty... It's quite unique, actually. I quite like it for that. Block! No! Oh, what a save for Gashiguchi. Here we go, Kamada. Oh, what skill! Oh, and what a goal from Kamada! That is such a good goal to start off the game with. And what a great bit of skill there from him. And there he is. He's got a real face as well, which is really good because I always like players that have that. And yeah, so good bit of skill to cut inside, great finish. I mean, he's he's gonna be really good, I feel. Minamino, over to Kamado again. Back to Minamino. Place it, no. Just rushed it there. Oh, good save. Uh, this guy's really good at attacking. He's gonna score at some point, so I need to get another one, really. Oh, Kubo. No. Oh, he's disconnected. Well, that's fine with me. But, uh, yeah, good first game. Good goal from Kamada. Yeah, let's get on to the second one, see if I can get some more goals with him and the rest of the team. Right, here we go. Who have we got here? Oh. This might be another forfeit incoming. Yep, through two. Takafusa. Come on. Another player who's done well recently. Nakata. No. Nakata. Oh, that's pretty close. Ooh Here we go. Nakajima. Oh, just scuffs it so badly. Okay, it could be a big problem here with Sane. Oh, interception from Tomiyasu. That was lucky. Nakata. No, can't. <laughs> can't time finish today. 
Okay, half time. First thoughts on Kamada. So he looks like he can finish well, but the big problem is his touch, and he's not quite fast enough. Uh, touch was a problem the guy had, but you know the pace, the lack of pace, is going to be a problem. Again, he seems really good at dribbling, and no, no, good save. Minamino goes round one. Oh, and he cuts it back to Kubo, who can't quite get the shot away. Still nil nil. Here we go, Yamaguchi, on the break, come on, Kubo, forward, forward, oh, cuts back, nice, over to Yamaguchi, no, the shooting on Yamaguchi, oh no, just so bad. I'll give it, oh, what a save, Gashiguchi, that was, he was really unlucky with the way the ball went there, oh, that's a great, well, it's a ball through to Canada. Who is dribbling is really good. Once he has the ball, once he has the ball, you can't get it off him. Unless you tackle him. But that was like that's what Kamada is good at, just the dribbling. But here we go. Oh, so close, and it's a corner. That was heading bottom corner from Nakata. Kamada. Dribbling is just too good. Here we go though. The Carter gets there. Oh, I shouldn't have hit it ahead of myself, but I did. And Kubo. Oh dear. Over to Nakajima. Surely, surely. No. Come on. I don't. Please don't end nil nil. This is gonna be so boring if it does. Oh, I've jinxed myself, haven't I? No, no. Last second penalty. Tommy Asu gives it away. Oh dear. <sighs> bottom left. Oh, I dived too early and he went bottom right. And it's a last minute goal. So annoying. Right. Go. Kubo, pass to Guerrero. Not too tricky though. No, Rusion. Rusion's just too good. Well, I did lose in the end, but at least Kamado wasn't as bad as I thought at half time. I decided I've sort of found out how to use him, if that makes sense. And he's sort of a player that you can sort of run off, which is brilliant because you've got Nakajima and Kubo who can just run off easily and they have better shooting so they can score. Uh, but yeah, he's really good at dribbling. His dribbling is really good. Um, but it's just when he gets the ball, his touch is not always that good. Yeah, and also, yeah. But uh, what would I say? So, if at right wing, you're going to want Kubo. I mean, but if you don't have Kubo, I'd still recommend Ito because I don't think 81 pace is enough on my wing. And he's not got, like, in, uh, enough shooting or dribbling to make up for his lack of pace. Um, so, I wouldn't use him on the wing. You could use the reverse cam, but you'd have to sum him on or change it around. And I suppose you can put M Minamino at cam and... Mod at right wing and then swap them over. That would work because Minamino's got enough pace. Put him in at striker. is probably the if you have a Japanese team, it's probably the better one though. Bundesliga, of course, you've probably got way better op options than Kamada. But yeah, so I would personally put him at striker because there's just lack of options. Haven't tried out a Kobayashi yet, but Kobayashi might be better than Kamada just because he's got more shooting. But in this case, Kamada's not too bad, um, and he could he could shoot as we saw in the first game. And his dribbling's really good, so he could. I think he's better than the guy. Is he better than Kobayashi? I don't know because I haven't used Kobayashi, but he's certainly a good option and very nice to have on the team. But yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. Silver, silver video coming out very soon about Spain. So yeah, if you watch this long to video, that's that's the theme of that. But yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed this video, and yeah, I'll see you next time.